Hey guys, so I just wanted to make this non-spoilery video of Detective Pikachu. So it's been, uh, two weeks? Yeah, two weeks since it was released. I saw it a week after it was released, so, and I saw it exactly a week before today, uh, being a Friday, and Memorial Day weekend. So I got my pajamas, I kind of look stupid, and this lighting is bad, let me fix it that. There we go. Um, so I got some Pokemon cards I saw. It. Actually, let me just say, this is my binder full of, like, exclusive set cards. It's like the, t the Detective Pikachu set and Shining Legends Ultra Rares. So, you're supposed to get this card when you see it, but my friends and I, we didn't get that card, but my friend, Cool Minecraft, uh, I can't say his real name, but that's his Xbox name on my uh, on my, on my cool Minecraft streams. No, on my uh, Fortnite streams, he gave me it. Uh, he got an extra. Maybe it was his brother's or something, and his brother didn't want it. I forgot what he said, but um, I mean I have it. <laughs> um, but I did also buy some cards when I was at the mall. So I bought one of those new uh, Unbroken Bonds booster packs, and I got this. And then Robert also bought me this really rare card from Steam Seed. So thanks to him. Um, the movie. I thought it was really good. If you're expecting a Pokemon movie that's going to teach you every single thing about Pokemon. And uh, you're going into the movie without any knowledge of Pokemon. Then the movie, like, it's fine for people that don't know anything about Pokemon. But at the same time, it's not going to explain everything to you. It kind of, it's a story in the Pokemon world. Like, when you have a movie that takes place on Earth, you don't really have to explain it. You already know history and stuff. Like, you're not going to walk into a movie and then they teach you how the world works. Or, n never mind. Actually, some movies do, but, like... This is not a Pokemon movie that's going to teach you everything about Pokemon. You walk in there, when you walk out of the theater, if you didn't know anything about Pokemon, you're going to learn a lot, but you're not going to, you you probably won't get it when people say fire type or this type or like they talk about certain Pokemon. I think that might be why it got some of the uh, criticism criticisms that it did and it got bad reviews, but it's really not a bad movie. I have the free GameStop poster back there. Um, but I do like how it's like a story in the Pokemon world, unlike just a Pokemon movie. Um, and it does reference other events from things. I'm not sure if, like, the Pokemon show was supposed to be canon to it. Um, I'm really not, but it, it's a good movie, guys. You should definitely see it if you're into video games and... If you have any knowledge of Pokemon, even if you don't, if you're interested. I mean, if you hate it, then that's a different story. I didn't get some of the things from it. I should definitely see it a second time. But I'm going to end the video here. Yeah. Uh, and yes, this is my sort of vlog setup. I, this is where I do, um, like... This is where I did that video, like, Phoenix Productions has a mental breakdown, part three he's coming out, what? Yeah, this is where I did that video. Um, I'm going to be posting my Team 11 teaser, uh, that'll probably already be out by the time this is uploaded, or maybe this will be uploaded first. Yeah, I think this will be uploaded first, um, but I already finished that. Tomorrow, I'll have Team 11 episode and a Fortnite stream along with a vlog with my pu uh, my cousins, my cousins. Um, so that'll be fun. And then on Sunday, I'm most likely gonna have a third Fortnite video and a weekly update. And then Monday, I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do on Monday. Monday, I'm most likely not gonna post anything because there's some stuff happening and I'm insanely busy. Um, without further ado, that is the end of this video. Go see Detective Pikachu. Also see Endgame. My foot is being squeaky on this plastic thing underneath my...
desk. Anyways, um, you'll see Detective Pikachu. I'm not gonna do a spoiler video on it. I was gonna do like a spoiler video about Detective Pikachu a month after it came out. Same with Endgame. Then I realized, like in my Endgame vlog, I already spoke my opinion, even though I didn't talk about spoilers. I said it was a great movie. I basically stated what I took away from it without spoilers. And I'm doing the same here, so I don't really think it would be, um, I don't really think that I need to make, a, like, a spoiler reaction, like, me talking about spoilers. But I do want to see the movie again, because there's some questions that I have. Um, I'm most likely not going to... I'm mostly gonna, gonna do like a spoiler video, but it's not like a spoiler review, it's more of like my friends and I discussing um, like questions we still had at the end of the movie, and like like just like talking about like mysteries and stuff um, that are still at the end of the movie. Um, I was just messing around with this War Machine figure from Iron Man 3. Um, these are all these unfinished customs that are work in progresses, and then there's even other ones like Captain Marvel and Rocket that are worse, and then there's some that are only legs and hair like this. Um, yeah, that's it. Um, yeah, that, that's it. Uh, so yes, I, I got off topic from Detective Pikachu like an hour ago. It's only six minutes. Um, but yeah. Gonna end the video right here, mainly because I uh, try to make this quick before my parents walk in. I I, I have pajamas on. I'm supposed to go to sleep. Um, yeah. I'm TMI. I guess I don't really care. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And in June, I will have higher quality stuff coming out. I have a big thing, and I'll talk about it in the weekly updates coming out day after tomorrow. Bye, I guess.